We need a refreshing. We need our cups to be filled once again. Not only filled, but run over. Jesus used up the oil that we had. We used up what you give us from time to time. Well, we burnt this oil up, trying to keep our garments from being spotted. We used this oil witnessing the people. Lord, we use it. Stand up and resist the devil. Lord, we every time, every day, this oil is being used. Every day, Lord, our lamps are burning to be a light, to be an example, to help others. Lord, this is why we need you, Jesus. We need you, Lord, to take these lamps, clean these gloves up. God, take this wind and let it become a brand new wind. These globes, all the smut and all the stuff that have hindered, that have caused these globes not to shine as bright as they should. Take away the smut. Jesus. Jesus. Without you, we can do nothing. Lord, we're like those wise virgins. We're in the midnight hour. We're in the midnight hour. And what oil we have had, we have used it. Lord, what we have had, we have used it upon others. We've used it in intercessory prayer. We need more. We need more of that oil. If we're going to be able to pray an intercessory prayer for others, then Lord, we need that oil. We need that anointing. Cause of the anointing. The yoke is destroyed. Burden is lifted. We need that oil. We need that anointing that comes through that oil to destroy these yokes. We can't destroy these yokes in our own ability, in our own strength. It's not by our might. It's not by our power. But it's by your spirit. By your spirit. This is why we come aside. This is why we come waiting upon you. We're waiting upon you. We recognize we're going to get anything. We're going to have to come aside. Wait upon you. You said they that wait upon the Lord. We renew their strength. Teach us to wait upon in prayer, in supplication. Oh, Jesus. 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 Oh, Jesus. How I Teach me, Lord. Teach me.
peace of the Lord to wait in your presence. Teach us, Lord. Lord, build an altar once again. I remember a message, Lord, you gave us back years ago. We have an altar. Lord, I thank you. You gave Abraham an altar. And Abraham met you in that altar. You gave Moses an altar. And that was a place where man met with you. That was a place where man called upon you. That was a place where man felt you. But you gave Jacob when he was running, trying to find his destiny. He built rocks running from Esau. But Lord, he built, he spoke to him a ladder come from heaven. And you stood beside that ladder. And Lord, that place became sanctified. And when it became sanctified, Jacob built a bunch of rocks. And there he built an altar. And there he prayed and called upon him. He presented his sacrifice to him. Or an altar is where we present our bodies. An altar is where we present ourselves a living sacrifice. Holy, acceptable, which is only a reasonable service. Help us not to be conformed to this world. But be transformed by the renewing of our mind. We wait upon you. Lord, that our minds might be renewed. We wait upon you. God, for our spirit to be rekindled. For the fire once again to burn in these altars. Lord Jesus. Lord, help us to build an altar right now. On our knees, waiting upon you, praying to you. And Lord, to have an altar in our homes, that every one of us have an altar, whether it's in our bedroom, or our closet, wherever, Lord, we can find a place, steal ourselves before you. Jesus. Everybody need an altar. Everybody need a place daily where they can come aside. You said, enter into the closet. Shut the door. Help us to shut the world out. Help us to shut our problems out. To shut everything out. And just focus upon you. Concentrate upon you. Meditate upon you. Love you. Give thanks to you, Lord. Jesus. Recognize how much we need you in this time. We need you in this hour. We need you in this day. More than we need houses. More than we need land. Lord, I hear this going to be a power ball tonight. Billion dollars. Lord, I need you more than I need to win a power ball. What good would it profit me to win the power ball, to gain the whole world and lose my soul? My soul is worth more than all the riches. All the gold, all the silver. I can be popular. I can be famous. I can be the greatest in the world. But Lord, without you, I'm nothing. I'm nothing without you. I'm nothing without you. These things, they appear today and they're gone tomorrow. What is life? But a vapor that appeared for a moment 
then it perishes away. All flesh is grass, and the glory of man is like the flower, and the flower faded, and the grass withered. But God, He that abides in you, in your word, in your spirit, will live forever. Bring us into that place where we abide in you, where we have your life in us, where we have that eternal life. Jesus, Jesus, we wait on you tonight. We wait on you tonight. We need you, Lord. We need you, Jesus. Oh, God, give us oil. Give us oil for our lamps. Our lamps is running low. God, some of us have ran out of oil. We only have fingers. We only have a little smoke. We need some real oil. We need a fresh fire. A fresh touch. A fresh anointing. In our lives in this time. Jesus, make us in here while we're waiting upon you. Lord, we're just like that clay that Jeremiah saw. God, you took that clay that had been messed up and you made it again. God, we're like that clay. Our lives has been all messed up. Make us again. Make us again. Lord, while we wait on you in these altars, let these altars be a place where you mold us again. Let these altars be a place where you move all the spots. Move all the blemishes. Move all the wrinkles. All of the things, Lord, that needs to be corrected. Lord, correct us. Correct us, Lord. Have mercy upon us. Jesus. This is why we're taking this week out. This is why we're coming aside. This is why we're on our knees now. Because we recognize the powers of Satan. The devil is like a roar loud, seeking to be made about. But Jesus, we wait upon you. Give us strength. Give us what it takes to stand, to withstand. Give us what it takes. Give us the wisdom to know how to give an answer. To those that's going to come to us in the midnight hour and ask us for help and ask us for direction. God, we need you. God, we need you. God, we need you. God, we call upon you. God, we make it. We're destitute. We're poor. We're miserable. Clothe us with the garment of salvation. Jesus. Jesus. Look into our hearts. Look with every plant that you haven't planted. Move out every obstacle. Jesus. You promise. You would come to us. One more time. But you can't put new wine in old bottles. God, take these old bottles. Take these old skins. Soak them. Let them become new skins. Where your spirit can enter in. Not leak out. Seal up the leaks. God, so much have leaked out. Through our mouth. So much have leaked out through us being entertained by vanity, television, Facebook, all this other stuff. Seal these leaks up. Seal these leaks up. Seal these leaks up. God, don't let us do the wrong thing. God, don't let us speak the wrong thing. 
things. Don't let us see the wrong things. Don't let us say the wrong things. Order our steps in your word. Lead us. Guide us. God, it's time we know your spirit. It's time we be led by your voice. My sheep know my voice. You said in the stranger that I follow. Me that are led by your spirit. By the sons of God. Lead us. How can we be led if we don't know his voice? If we don't know the leading of your spirit? Lord, we are your son. You are your daughters. Teach us, Father. Teach us to be led. Teach us how to answer. Teach us where to go, what to do. Teach us, Lord. We're like the men in the Bible. Said, I'm Solomon said, I don't know how to go out and come in. Give me wisdom. God give us wisdom to know how to come out and go in to a world that's in the darkness. To a world that needs answers. To a world that's under a curse. To a world that's suffering. To a world that's sick. We can't help them if we're empty. We cannot help them. Lord, if we need help, God, give us something. Fill these vessels. Fill these empty vessels up. Fill these vessels. Fill them with your spirit. Fill these vessels with your spirit. Tell him, Lord, I'm poor in spirit. Lord, I'm poor in spirit. I'm bankrupt when it comes to your power. I'm bankrupt when it comes to the things of God. Lord, I'm poor in spirit. He said, blessed are the poor in spirit. For there is in the kingdom of heaven. God, God, we're poor in spirit. We're poor
and loose. Red coals. Got to have you, Lord. We got to have you.
would come search him all. Would come, my God, Lord, to you, my God, to fill us with that oil, Lord. God, we want to be among the wise virgins. We want to be among the, the, the ones that pray.
Mandabu Kaseyo Mashiach. 